This is this is at uh, sheepnomore.net, Sheep Media, HR 5087, the Federal Assault Weapon Ban of 2018. These are the sweethearts that. Uh, let you know that uh, it, it's coming. So it begins. They had 150 other Democrats sign on to this bill. Let's see if it says, but anyway, like I said, it's 150 people, Democrats signed on to the bill. They introduced it February 26, 2018. Now, you know, this gun debate settled a long, long time ago. And to me, these people are the most un-American, unpatriotic people in the whole world. They don't care about your rights. Now, they've got, they had all these laws. Every time you turn around, oh, we need more gun laws. We need more gun laws. Well, they passed these laws. And what do they do? Do they curb gun violence? No. Do they, they, do they do anything? Yes. It gives them more control over you, your everyday life. It never solves anything. Nor does it keep people from harm. It's control. It's what it's about. Well, these people aren't smart enough to control. They put words into on a piece of paper and say, "Hey, you got to follow this." Well, you can call it civil dif di civil disobedience. You don't have to obey bad laws, and that's what these are. It's control over you. We have a God-given rights, not negotiable. We have a constitution, and there's no compromising. We have a bill of rights, and there's no compromising. Now, I, I, I'm, I'm not, not sure how I really want to voice this, but I think I'm at the point where I'm going to revoke my consent to be governed. I follow the Constitution, I follow the Bill of Rights, keep my hands clean, my nose clean, even wipe my behind once in a while. But I am not going to stand around and let them undermine and tear up the Constitution of the United States in any manner. And you should do that too. You know, what, where's the outrage? Where's the outrage? These people should be tried for sedition. No, the law, the law common sense laws, you know, there's right and wrong. Always has been. But to keep picking on this, and since they got a toehold toe back in 1968, they keep on and on and on and on. It ends. It ends for me. I'm done with this. I Until they get back to doing the constitutional ways and they bring back justice where, the, where these people and in, in, uh, uh, these elites up here in the White House and the Congress and the Senate and other places don't get away with murder. It ends. It's awful hard to be proud of your government when they can when they can do all this stuff and get away with it. That's not justice. Whereas the poor guy out on the street, if he jaywalks, he's in jail. If he driving down the road, he gets in jail. It doesn't matter. The little guy suffers, and these guys here, 
they walk away scot-free. If you look at Waco, look at Ran uh, Ruby Ridge, you look out there in uh, Nevada, the land grab, people getting killed, nobody, nobody pays for it except the person standing up to the government. They've overreached. Now we need to have rallies, we need to be protesting and do what we can, but like I said, I revoke my consent to be governed by a bunch of nitwits. They do a lot of talking, but they only want one thing, and that's control. Control over you. Now, this is a free country, and it's going to stay that way as long as we're alive. May have to shed some blood up, up there, but... Uh, now that's life. These, pe these people have a purpose. They're obsessed with destroying the United States of America. I don't care what they say. Anyone, anybody who doesn't stand up for the Constitution, like these sons of bitches right here, they're the enemy. They are the enemy of the people. They are the enemy of our nation. If they would get away from gun control, they could get a hell of a lot done. But no, they focus all their energy on something that uh, doesn't make sense. It was settled 227 years ago, people. 1791. You don't have any right to en encroach upon the Constitution in any manner or the Bill of Rights. If you don't know the law, if you don't know the Constitution, that's another thing. We've got the Supreme Court up there judging. They sure as hell don't know what the hell the Constitution is about or this country wouldn't be in such dire peril as it is right now. And it is. Unless you people stand up and, and start t taking time to go march in the street and protest, it's, nothing's going to get done. You'll be slaves. I'm not going to be a slave. I won't be a slave to a nitwit. Like I said, I revoke my consent to be governed.